Hi guys, what's up, Jason here, and welcome back to a brand new FIFA 18 player review on my channel. Now, in today's video, guys, I'm going to be reviewing 84 rated Inform Lanzini. Now, towards the start of FIFA 18, everyone seemed to have Lanzini's normal card um, in their team, just because it was really cheap and a really, really good card. Um, now, he's going to go himself an Inform card, um, I'm, and now I'm starting to see him more again in teams, um, due to him picking up this Inform card, and the main reason is just because this card is so good, um, especially for the price you're paying for around Xbox um, at this current time I think it's going for around 20,000 coins if not lower um, what's pretty crazy for an Argentina 84 rated in form from the Premier League so getting into his first pro now what is his agility this guy has 90 agility as his in-game stat was absolutely insane um, I always as I say this in basically every single one of my reviews agility is the most important stat when it comes to scaling because you know it affects how agile the players are and how quickly they do perform the skill moves so the next pro I could find with this card was his dribbling now this guy has a really really good dribbling as you can see from that goal there he just kept it so close to his feet and he can dribble with both his left um, and his right foot just because he's have a four star weak foot and then the final pro I could find with this card was his creativity and when I say creativity I mean the way he creates chances you know this guy I basically think he's the perfect cam for FIFA 18 maybe you're lacking a bit of height and a bit of strength but apart from that this guy is just so so good um, you know he's always creating chances he gets goals he gets assists he reminds me a lot of Ericsson in real life um, you know just seems to just basically everything in the attacking calf so as you can see he's got medium medium work rates while is pretty good for a cam to be honest um not the probably high medium would be preferable but um medium mediums not too bad so as you can see there he can also finish on his left foot getting a nice low driven finish there into the bottom corner so in the next chance here i do a nice running double touch spin there um do some drag backs i'm just keeping the ball there just trying to taunt my player uh, my opponent waiting for them to come in for the tackles go for a nice roulette past the player there run through and goal do a nice ball roll to ronaldo chop and again finish it off very very nicely so if you're looking for a player who can sort of um get the assists and also score goals and you're sort of on a tight budget then i would definitely recommend to pick up lanzini um it's just a very very good card you could even try this guy at striker um he's probably a little bit lacking in pace for a striker just because i think he's around 84 pace um and you know it's pretty um decent but maybe a little bit too low for a striker and he's finishing as well um it was good for me um but i think it's only around 79 so i wouldn't recommend playing this guy at striker maybe center forward would be a decent position um but i definitely think the best position to play this guy in is the cam position so as you can see there we do a nice spin pass at defender run through on goal um it uses his strength there to spin past the player does a nice roulette there runs in between the space takes a finesse shot and then finishes it off very very nicely into the top corner so guys this has been the review if you have enjoyed it don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to my channel thanks for watching and see you next time